And we're here at the Total stand, and joining me now is Hatem Nusebe. He is the president of Total UAE. Thank you so much for joining us now. You're very busy here in the UAE. Tell me a little bit about the business here, and how important is this region for you? Well, Etna, you know that uh, the UAE, and Abu Dhabi especially, is one of the most important countries for Total. If you look and compare us to other oil companies in the country, you will see that we have a very widespread. We are present in the concessions in Atco, in Adma. We are present in Gasco. We are present in Adgaz. But we have Total Abu Bukhush, which we are producing, as you know, uh, one of the few majors who have an oil field that we are producing ourselves. We are present in Tawila. We are present in the Shams. We have a, a factory in uh, Dubai for the lubricants. So we are really uh, present in many different aspects of the oil business and non-oil business because energy business, I would say, in Abu Dhabi. And that is because Abu Dhabi is so important for us as Total. Now, of course, uh, that keeps you very, very busy too. But technology has really changed this industry. Not so much changed, but it's always led this industry. And your background as an engineer, you'd know that's at the heart of everything you do. I, my, not my background. I am still an engineer. I consider myself an engineer. But it's true. Total has always been successful because that we gave technology such a big importance. And I'll give you two examples. If you go downstairs in our stand, you will see uh, the computer we have, this Pangea computer, which is amazing. It's an amazing jump in technology, which will allow companies to better understand what is under the ground, whether it is in the interpretation of seismic or whether it is in simulation of reservoirs. This will allow us to maximize the oil recovery from the reservoirs more than we could before. That's important. Secondly, as you know, we operate the Abu al Bukhush field, which is on the uh, on the frontier between Iran and Abu Dhabi. It's on the borders. Now we have been using this uh, field to try many technologies which could be used not only in the field of Abu al-Bukhush but elsewhere in Abu Dhabi. I mean, I remember 20 years ago we started injecting gas and then this methodology was used in other fields. Uh, we, st we were the first to start also horizontal wells. Now we are going to do some chemical injection projects. All of these projects are not made uh, to bring money from Total Abu Bukush because, as you know, the oil reserves are small there. But they are very useful for Abu Dhabi because the same methodology, technology we are using in Abu Bukush can be used on the huge fields and will allow us to maximize the recovery in the fields of Abu Dhabi. Help in maximizing because we work together, you know. Now we're hearing at this conference still that every year we hear this is the challenge in bringing new talent into the industry. What is Total doing to entice that talent, to bring it in and to keep it? Our main objective here is the emeritization. As you know, we have been in this country for almost 75 years. Next year we are, and I hope to be here, that Total will be here in 75 years time. And this is why we have made such a big effort at recruitment and training of Emirati nationals. I'm very proud, for example, of what we call the ABK Academy, which takes in young Emiratis, trains them. And initially, these people were working on the ABK field, but now we are sending them to work on various fields, including ADMA fields, for example. This is part of our general training for the locals in order to have as many locals as possible training and working on the fields. We have also sent a large number of Emiratis to work, whether it's in our headquarters in Paris or with on-the-job training in other parts so that we can give them the benefit of working with an international oil company. You know, IOC's the advantage of working with an IOC is that you gain international experience in many different countries, many different types of fields, many different types of technologies. So we want to bring it here to the UAE, and to be able to bring it here, we have to expose the UAE nationals to all of these technologies. Now, I know Total has also been involved in Young Adipec. Um, is it very important that how do you think that you capture the younger generation, even, you know, not, not on a graduate level, but the young generation, to get them interested in science and engineering at a very young age? I think that the young people feel, when we talk to them, 
that we are a company that values very highly technology, engineering, and they feel that we value very highly the people who are interested in this. You know, we have, I, I think I have the most wonderful job any person can have anywhere in the world. Why? Because of this mixture we have of high tech, plus relationships, plus training, plus economics, plus everything. No other job is like the oil business. You know, there's nothing like the oil business. So, and tell me, how has the oil business been here at Edipec 2013? Is this a good place for Total to be here at the conference and exhibition this year? You know, last year, I came here as a visitor. I was based in another country. And I saw Edipec, which was very good. And when they told me there's another Edipec this year, I said, but they are crazy. I mean, you know, one doesn't have uh, every year. So I was expecting to maybe to see uh, that uh, there aren't many people here. And I'm very happy to see, on the contrary, this year is even more successful than it was last year. And it shows, you know, if you look at the total presence here, it is far more important than our presence last year. And I think all of this shows three things. One of them is the importance of Abu Dhabi to Total, the importance of Abu Dhabi to the other oil companies, and the importance of Abu Dhabi to the oil business in general. And I think Adipec is the best example of these three things. Super, Hatem. Thank you so much. Thank you very much.